All right, welcome back. On this video, I want to talk a little bit about what's coming up in 2018. What is going on in 2018? Well, first of all, let me say 2017 has been a very good year for me and my company. And moving forward, we want to incorporate a way for you to be able to say that about you and your company at the end of 2018. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be demonstrating and helping you set up a system that will allow you to generate an uh, income based on a couple of things um, in 2018, but specifically understanding how to set up an email marketing system. Email marketing systems are one of the least, I'll say in my opinion, one of the least expensive systems that you can set up online to generate money. And it can be done without you even creating a product. It can be done simply by you setting the system up and using other people's products to generate an income by selling their products. That's called affiliate marketing for those of you who are new to this process. And those of you who are not new, you knew that already. But one of the things that I really want you to focus on this year is simply this. Right now, today you probably don't know who I am you probably have no idea you probably don't know if you can trust me you probably don't know if you like me and you probably don't know if what I have to offer you you would even be interested in but the way life works is that if I'm continually in front of you if I continue to give you value if I continue to share information or if I continue to teach you, if you will, then over a period of time, all that will shift. Now, <laughs> if you don't like me, that time won't take long at all. You'll, wait, wait a minute, I don't want to hear this guy. <laughs> he never speaks about anything I'm interested in, right? And, and I have those people too. So, you know, I won't take offense to that. But for those of you who are interested in doing something different in 2018, I'm going to do a couple of things, actually. One of the things that I'm going to do, um, and that's just for my own uh, growth, and because I'm kind of a perfectionist when it comes to certain things, but I'm going to add an additional 200 videos to my system in 2018. Just my system alone, not Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter, and all those. But for my system alone, now as I create videos, quite naturally, my system automatically sends them to those places, which is what allows you to see who I am and understand what it is that I, I do. So, uh, and that's exactly the way you should set your system up as well. But the main thing I want you to understand about um, what I'm talking about is what I'm going to be introducing you to and who I'm going to be introducing you to are going to be a, um, a variety of things that you you may or may not be familiar with at this point and that's perfectly okay that's actually the way I like it because that means what I'm sharing with you um, you're getting maybe for the first time and then when you get things for the first time you have a tendency to go 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 until it either um, ma uh, manifests itself into what it's supposed to or until you find out hey that's not the way it works Right? And that's one of the reasons that I'm here is to cut that time in half or, you know, maybe even, you know, give, given the benefit that of the experience that I've had, it may allow you to cut five years off of your actual learning curve, right? And if you can cut five years off of your learning curve, that's a big, um, an addition to the amount of money that you'll be making because you'll be making money. That's five years of making money that you wouldn't have been able to do because you would have been learning, right? Now, the question you may ask yourself is, yeah, but how much is that going to cost me, right? Well, let me say this. Um, first of all, I'm a, I'm a large proponent on investing in you, whoever you are. I invest in myself, and I don't think about, uh, is that too much money? What I do is I invest 
my time and research to understand the people that I'm studying. And if the people that I'm studying can shorten my path, then I will invest money. But if I don't know those people and I don't feel familiar with what they're offering, then I'm not going to invest a dime. So I don't have a, a problem not investing my money, but one of the things that I do do is when I invest in a product and I like that product, I will speak about that product to different places, right? I'll talk about how well that product worked for me and my system. Because uh, one of the examples is I have a podcast show that I do also. And, you know, that's just um, something I do on the side to create another audience simply because I wanted to know how that works. And I'm a speaker, so being a speaker, it allows me to get in front of a microphone and actually to talk on a regular basis so that I can hear myself. Because when you're hearing yourself speak, and then you can visually see how you were while you were speaking, then you can kind of get it. Uh, it kind of sinks into your spirit, into your soul a lot faster and a lot deeper, right? And that's what we want to do, but we don't want to do that overnight. We want to do it over a period of time. So uh, it's based on consistency. You want to do things consistently over a period of time. And that's how you shift who you are. That's how you shift from who you are today to who you are want to be tomorrow and it's a process but the the thing about it is it can be so much fun because one of the things i'm focusing on this year is i'm going to kind of let me see how can i say this i'm going to plot or i'm going to actually consciously create right so that i can help you guys consciously create i'm going to make some mistakes along the way i'm going to introduce you to those mistakes i'm going to uh, make some things go really well along the way and I'm going to also share that with you too. Because one of the things I know is knowledge and power doesn't come from gaining it. It comes from sharing it. It comes from sharing what you get. Because I can have all of it in my, in my head alone. But if I just don't share it, if I just keep it there, yeah, I'll know I have it. But that doesn't benefit the world. That doesn't benefit my community. And, and that's another thing I want you to focus on on these videos is that there's a lot of people online doing a lot of different things, talking about a lot of different things. But from an African-American perspective, from a position of being a black person in America, you know, our journey is different than other nationalities, other races. Our journey is specifically ours. <laughs> and, and you know what I'm talking about. So... From that perspective, I want to introduce you to me, Larry James. That is the walk that I have walked through my life. I've always been a black man. I always will be a black man. And when I share information about the things that I've learned and the path that I would like for people to take, it's from that perspective of my being an African American or a black man in this country. So. All I want you to understand is that if you're going to learn from people, always be mindful that certain people that can teach you certain things, the tool is good, but the technique won't always work because of their perspective on life, right? And um, having said that, I just want you to realize that I will always be coming to you from a position of the way I had to do it, <laughs> right? Because, you know, we all, want, we all want to be successful in life to a certain degree. Success is kind of speculative. Spe speculative. It just depends on, you know, how you see it. But uh, from looking back from where you come from to where you are today, you actually probably can admit that you've wasted a lot of time. Uh, you, you know, you would uh, be a lot farther ahead if you were able to focus a lot a lot more and not spend so much time with the uh, with the naysayers or with the you know people who really don't want to do anything in their lives and, that, and that's what you have to be able to uh, kind of break away from you have to be able to break, even if you're in that environment you have to psychologically be able to break away from that and just go into a zone so that you're not constantly consumed by that type of uh, rhetoric or that that narrative that things are not uh, 
ever going to change or ever going to be better because they can always change and they can always be better. And But they can do none of that without your assistance. It's going to take you. You are going to have to uh, be the CEO of your life, not me. You're going to have to take control of that. And if you're willing to do that, then I can help you to get to another level. One of my favorite words that I've been focusing on and sharing with in 2017 is that word level. Because whatever level you're on in life is, is kind of the way you act. And, and people that ascend to different levels are able to identify the level below them because they were there. <laughs> it only makes sense, right? So, the, as you're on this level, it's okay for you to be on this level. Everything is great. You can get on this level and everything can be great as well. But you can also get on that level and everything not be so great. Right? That's the way it works. So you have to still maintain control all along the growth process, all along the system. And when you're able to do that, you're able to be at peace and comfortable as you grow. A lot of times people grow and all of a sudden they get their hands on $5,000 and kind of lose their mind, right? They want to buy everybody drinks and, you know, take everybody on a vacation. What? You're just learning. You really, you're, you know, whoop. That was probably an accident that ha that happened. You know, how did that happen? Because you, a lot of times you can't repeat that process. Or you'll repeat it, repeat it, repeat it, repeat it, but you're not adding anything different. You're not including anything else that would bring uh, revenue or would generate another source of income. And uh, that's only because you only know that level. So, you know, kind of pace yourself. And once the system kind of takes over, and it will take over if you continue to work it, it will because... Uh, this is actually going into my eighth year. 2018 is actually going into my eighth year in my company. And over that time, uh, the amount of things that I've learned the, and the amount of things that I've become comfortable with has, has shifted drastically simply because of the Internet. I've, I've done probably, uh, I would actually say 100% of my learning has come from either the internet, seminars, events, networking events, or, you know, just my own um, coaching programs that I've set up to assist other people, just like you guys. And as I set up systems to share those systems, the curriculum and everything involved, that process is a learning process for me as well. Now, I have to learn that from someone else. So that goes back to where who I'm studying and what, I'm, what am I studying those people for. I'm studying those people so that I can sh get what they're sharing. And when I get what they're sharing, if I like it well enough and it seems like it, it's a fit for my system, I'll incorporate it into my system. Like one of the things that I really enjoy sharing and teaching people how to do is setting up consulting businesses. Because consulting businesses are based on what you like and what you know. And when you set that type of thing up, you can do that from day one because you already know what you like. All you're going to do is you're going to be formatting things to talk about, positioning yourself in a way to talk about what you like, what you already like. Like, if you know about basketball, I can put you in front of a video just like this one and have you talk about basketball as long as you want to. You can set up little, um, okay, I'm going to talk. This is what you can say. I'm going to talk for a minute and a half about three different basketball things, right? Three different things involved with basketball. So that's one video, two videos, three videos that didn't exist before you did that. They did not exist. You actually created that. Now, it's the same way with money. When you do what you do in this business, entrepreneurial world, you create money. That money is just floating around there in the universe waiting for someone to create it. And once you're able to create a system that generates that process over and over, repeats it, then it continues to create money. And that's where you come in. That's, what, that's when you make the moves that you know you can make because uh, now you're not just uh, getting a lottery kind of winnings. You're not just getting a one-time winning, but you're getting repeatedly uh, paid, right? So if you're making, even if you start out at, let's say, 
$50 a month. I know, $50 a month is no money. If you continue to do that, guess what will happen? That $50 will turn into $100. And if you don't stop, guess what? Right. That $100 will turn into 1000 And then 5000 And then that changes who you are. Right? That changes the whole dynamic. That changes the whole picture. Because not only do are you generating that type of money, but now you understand totally how that works. And you can bring other systems in as well to generate more and more money. And you're doing it doing that at your pace. That's that's the beautiful thing that I like to share with people about doing stuff like that. Uh, you're not being rushed, you're not uh, depending on that to create money today. You're, you're focusing on the big picture. And the big picture is, I am getting better at what I'm doing. I am becoming more familiar so that I can teach people. Because that's, what, that's all I'm doing with you guys. I'm teaching you what I've learned. And if you're interested, you'll watch. If you're not, you won't watch. Okay? So that's not really where my concern can be. My concern can only be, did I create that for them to watch? And then my job is done. Right? After that, my system that's already in place will send these videos and podcasts and books and CDs out to the places that I have uh, designated for them to send them out to. And we just sit back and wait and see what happens. Which we know what happens because it's what we do, right? It's how we're able to maintain and grow. Because see, one of the things people don't really incorporate when they're talking about growing something is that as you grow you have to maintain maintenance is not always easy because especially if you want to call yourself keeping up with somebody else and I definitely don't recommend you do that I definitely don't say keep up with anybody go at your pace that way you're comfortable that way you're not stressed out that way you're not uh, having to procrastinate with situations you know you shouldn't be procrastinating in. It's a process that should be comfortable for you. And if it's like that, then as people that are listening, they will start to see the genuineness in you, the uniqueness in you, just like you guys will with me. That's why I hope a lot of you guys are seeing me for the first time because I have over 500 videos on YouTube already. But... You know, if you hadn't seen those videos, that's okay. I have no problem with that. One of the things that I do do is I'm consciously aware that I will leave this planet at one at some time at some point. Consciously aware of that. And uh, are you? <laughs> because you will too. But what I'm doing also in my my system and the way my mind works is I'm also setting up a video series that my kids and my grandkids and my great grandkids and my great great grandkids and on and on and on can actually see right and then if either of them ever have a aspiration to do what it is that i'm doing they'll say boy wait my grandfather could do that he did all that so if he can do that i know i can do that and that could possibly be motivation for them and that's not okay it may be somebody that's not even related to me get it right so i'll be uh living vicariously even through death helping someone that's interested in doing what it is that i did right so you know when you are able to kind of wrap your mind around life from that perspective uh being realistically uh, understanding that you are you do have an expiration date and uh if you're going to be uh, looking at your life from a, let's say, a football perspective, uh, I'm getting ready to be 60 years old in uh, probably, let's see, today is November the something. Uh, I'll, on December the 23rd, I'll be 60. So at 60, I would say I'm probably in the fourth quarter of my life. <laughs> Right, and that's a good thing because getting old is the goal, right? The goal is not to die young. The goal is to get old and leave something for the next generation. Whether it be knowledge, money, uh, information, you want you want to leave all that, but 
it, it, it at least leaves some knowledge and some money because you know you don't want your kids and grandkids and great grandkids to start over at ground zero like you had to right so if you can help them not have to do that and then give them some uh, information or some financial education about how to grow money rather than just become a consumer and spend money or to look good like the next person and then struggle because you look good because uh, you can look good and not struggle oh, please know that please just know that you can look very well and not struggle that's not what you have to do but you have to not be going through life comparing who you are with the next person because as soon as you do that then you're competing and you, you're not in this world to compete you're not I know we see sports and all that all the time that's fun that's entertaining but that's not your reason for being here right you have a, a bigger reason a larger uh, purpose if you will and hopefully you um, kind of at some point you know get the mindset to chase that and you know you never know what direction it will put you uh, in in life well, having said that, I'm going to be creating uh, several more videos today because I'm really excited about where we are uh, with my company and going into 2018 because I'm going to be moving some things this year more so than ever. And I hope that you are doing the same thing in your life or in your company or in your world, so to speak. So if you're not Continue to watch these videos, like these videos, comment on these videos, and share these videos. Because you know that's the game, that's the world we're in, right? That's the way the game is played. You don't have to, but that's the way the game is played. Whether you do it, whether you don't. You know, some people will and some people won't. It's up to you, right? Again, my name is Larry James. My company is speakerlarry.com. And as always, share with someone else what I've shared with you.